Katie Price was reunited with her son Harvey on Wednesday, as they prepare to celebrate the festive season together. The former glamour model, 43, who was recently spared jail after being arrested for driving while drunk, posed with her fiancé Kyle Woods with her eldest son before taking him back to her home for Christmas. It came as it was also revealed a petition calling for Katie to be banned from adopting animals has doubled in signatures, after she gave away her daughter Princess Puppy Precious a member of the crew on her TV show. In the post she shared to Instagram, Katie and Kyle were in good spirits as they posed with Harvey. She penned the caption, just picked up Mr. Price. Can't wait for Christmas. It was then reported that a Change.org petition set up calling for Katie to stop owning any more pets, has garnered over 14,000 signatures. Katie reportedly gave away the pooch to a member of the crew of a recent TV show she has been filming. French bulldog Precious was a gift to the teen after her old dog Rollo got stuck under an armchair and died, before being found by Harvey's carer. Shortly after this incident, which occurred a year ago, the petition was launched. The description for the petition reads, A puppy has died in the last 24 hours in Katie Price's care She bought this puppy for her 13-year-old child three weeks ago, which was killed in an accident no one witnessed. In the last five years more animals have died from lack of care. Horses, dogs. Cats, lizards, hedgehogs. This isnt a single family tragedy. It's a common thing in Katie Price home. Two dogs have been run over. It goes on, puppies were found dead drowning in a neglected swimming pool. A horse was run over on a motorway. Animals just go missing in her home never to be seen again. Her guard dog broke into her neighbor's garden and killed their chickens. A dog trained to attack people. Also ripped her cat apart. The neglect seen on her show My Crazy Life. Cat poo with mold growing on it. Dog poo just left on the floor. Clothes dumped all over the place. Alger growing in her pool where her puppy drowned. She jokes about her mucky mansion. But it ain't a joke that animals are dying from her lack of care. Being left alone to meet untimely deaths and nobody is saying enough is enough and carry on selling her animals. Three weeks ago Buell dog puppy named Rolo was in her care. Nobody knows including her how it died. We need to stop this now no more animals need to die. It comes after she recently avoided spending time in jail when she was handed a 16-week suspended sentence and two-year driving ban for crashing her uninsured BMW X5 while disqualified and under the influence on a country lane on September 28. On Tuesday, The Sun reported Katie will put pen to paper to write her eighth autobiography in a plan to expose her enemies. A source said, Katie's contacted her publisher saying this one will be her most explosive yet, shall tell her side of what's happened this year. From her rose with her exes, escaping prison, the car crash, she's planning to go all in and name and shame her enemies. It will have a big focus on mental health and how she worked on hers in the Priory and hopes that readers and fans will be inspired by how she overcame her tough year. If she can do it, anyone can. Mail Online contacted Katie Price's representatives for comment at the time.